Hello everybody, welcome to the channel. Today I'll be reviewing the 20cc Gator Tough with the 90 horsepower Yamaha and also the 20cc Bay with the 115 VMAX Yamaha. All I can say about that 20cc Bay with the VMAX 115 from Yamaha, hands down rocket ship. That thing is crazy. Controllable. The top speed on that was about 45 mile an hour with 500 pounds of gear and people. The 20cc Gator Tough with the 90 horsepower Yamaha. Saw speeds of 36 mile an hour with the same weight and gear. A good cruising speed on the 20cc Gator Tough with the 90 horsepower was around 36 mile an hour. Seen speeds up to 38 with it, but without a lot of RPMs, you can cruise around 30, 32 mile an hour. The boats handled very, very well. Seen some big wake off of container ships, larger boats, speed boats, took them like a champ. We'll be doing more reviews of these boats in action at a later date. But today I broke in the 20 horsepower four stroke Yamaha on the 14 foot flat bottom duck boat. Again, very impressed. I'll make a different video about that one. They both have very, very large compartments. You can carry so much gear on these things. The live wells are great. Both of these boats will be used for striper fishing, flounder fishing down at the bay, uh, tubing with the kids. The 20cc Gator Tough with the 90 horsepower, that one will be used for all different species of duck hunting, flounder fishing, striper fishing, trot line crabbing. Again, if you have any questions about these G3 boats, go buy one, they're great. Depending on what motor you want, I have the 90 horsepower. I'm happy with it, performance is there fuel economies there we ran about six or seven hours and both used a little over half a tank of fuel the 115 v max that thing's fast really fast so if you're in for speed the maximum horsepower rating for the 20 cc's is 115 but i think that v max gives it just a little bit more i'm not sure that's pretty much all i have for now stay tuned for more videos more previews more adventures thank you